Tell them boys to tighten up. Tighten up. Let me hear you say it. Whole city getting hype now. Tell them boys to tighten up. Tighten up. Let me hear you say it. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Cass here, and we are here to continue on with the Tennessee Titans breakdown as we are going to deep dive into Tennessee Titans defensive tackle Tier Tart. Where we're going to look like. Well, we're going to look at his impact early on as an undrafted free agent of the University of Florida International. We're going to look at his days starting from East Mississippi Community College, going to Florida International, and his role on the defense going forward. So, let's get right into it. So, drafted, I mean, eligible to be signed in 2020. As an undrafted free agent, he didn't play much. Played a lot more in 2021. Got 16 combined tackles. Had one QB hit. Had two tackers for loss. And uh, really wasn't on the field all that much. Now, when we go into his career at his career at um, EMCC we see a guy that really played hard had eligibility to go to all Alabama, Arkansas, Kentucky, Mississippi State and decided to go to FIU he got offered by Kentucky, offered by Arizona, I mean Arkansas. He never really got the offer from Alabama, but his collegiate stats at FIU speak numbers. In 2018, his first year at FIU, he came in, played in 11 games, had 19 tackles, 7 for a loss, 4 sacks, his second year, playing 11 games as well, combining for 32 tackles, 10 and a half for loss, and a 1.5 sacks. When we get into the way he fits into the depth chart, right now it has him listed as the starting nose tackle. Now, when looking at Tier, is he going to be that pass rushing defensive tackle you hope, like a guy like Jarrell Casey was? No. He's much more of a run-stuffing defensive nose tackle. So, that's what you really hope to see in like a guy like Jeffrey Simmons or Denny Gautry, that they're going to be able to rush the passer more, even with getting help from a guy like Rashad Weaver or Limrell Murchison. Even a guy like Deshaun Hand, you hope that they could come in and provide you help that you're not going to get from the interior with a guy like Naquan Jones and Tier Tart, who are much more defensive run stoppers. So, I think he's key for stopping the run for this team, just like David Long and Zach Cunningham are. And overall, I'm very interested to see where Tier goes, trying to build up his career from here, starting all the way from back from his first seasons at AMCC all the way to FIU and onwards. If you guys enjoyed this episode of the Tennessee Titans Breakdown, remember to drop a like and subscribe. It might be a shorter episode here today. That's because these next two topics, with being Tier Tart and Dylan Ray Downs, there's not really a lot to talk about. So, anyway, I hope you guys like it. If you have a recommendation for the Tennessee Titans Breakdown, drop it in the comments and I'll get right to it. But above all else, this has been your boy Cass, and I am out. Bye, guys. Boys, are tighten up, tighten up. Let me hear you say. Whole city getting hype now. Tell them boys, are tighten up, tighten up. Let me hear you say. Nice.